A meeting that evokes memories of the 2019 Europa League final when Chelsea ran out 4-1 winners against Arsenal in faraway Baku. Today, Stamford Bridge is the venue. Derek Ray in the commentary position and Stuart Robson is alongside me. Stuart, what are you looking forward to seeing? Well, Derek, these are two big London clubs that expect to win trophies and we should get a good game here. There's some really top-class players on view today. the lineup for Chelsea well although it's down as a 4-5-1 it's more likely to be three players in behind the main centre forward and those three are key to this team's creativity And a look at the starting lineup for Arsenal. Martin Odegaard plays alongside Declan Rice in central midfield. And the centrepiece of the attack today is Gabriel Jesus. And this confrontation is underway. Declan Rice. Oh, he's left his marker for dead. Gabriel Jesus and there it is the opening goal the ideal way to start well here's the replay he does well to find that bit of space in the box and then he shows a lot of composure to finish it off that's a good goal so Chelsea restart the game can they come up with an answer Jackson given away by Chelsea Martinelli on to Jesus on the offensive Rice excellent block by Thiago Silva He continues his run. Now in a more than decent position. Martin Odegaard. And making headway. Really vital interception here. Mikhailo Mudrik. Perfect challenge. This attack looks highly promising. Can he finish? Oh, blocked it. Enzo Fernandez. Able to skip past his man. And the assistant referee has raised his flag. Offside. <laughs> giving the ball to the opposition that time. Now they have possession in a good area of the pitch. The fans want to see a shot, and the keeper there to deal with it.
Declan Rice. And he's lost custody of the ball here. Electing to shoot. And the keeper more than equal to the task. So can Chelsea take advantage of the corner kick situation? Enzo Fernandez. It's looking promising. And continues his run. Gabriel Jesus. Just failing to hit the target with his pass. And it'll be a throw-in. Well, as you can see, Chelsea have dominated the last 15 minutes and have created one or two good chances with it. If they can continue to play with this domination, it's only a matter of time before they draw level. And still danger here. Well, it could have been, but for the offside flag. Declan Rice. Gabriel Martinelli. And it's Gabriel Jesus. And it might be. Well, the keeper is happy. The bar was there. Can they put it away? And clears the danger. Free kick to Chelsea. And take it away. He won the ball. Caicedo might be a chance to break well it broke down alas and in with a real chance well the break looked promising but the danger has been averted good looking sequence the delivery danger still on this could level it and so the first half draws to a close. Second half underway, and Arsenal looking to build upon a largely positive first half performance. And it will be an Arsenal free kick. Sterling. Oh, what an opportunity. Well, fantastic reflex action from the goalkeeper. William Saliba. Martin Odegaard. Ben White. And here's Saliba. On to Jorginho. Bukayo Saka. Oh, he's through here. Oh, superb save. Massive credit to the keeper. Well, he's so hard to beat in these situations. It's brilliant goalkeeping. Not quite the clearance they were hoping for. And in the end, no damage done. Now, well, maybe room here for the counter attack. Arsenal did well to win back possession. Jorginho. Nicely time tackle. Mikhailo Mudrik. And played in. Sterling has it. And a big moment because the referee has pointed to the spot. Penalty coming up. Well, no card handed out. He gets away with a rebuke. Well, a lot of referees would have booked him there. 
but I'm with him on this one. No yellow card for me. And fluttered home. Well, his heart might have been fluttering, but he didn't show it. A goal from the spot. Well, a joy to watch. Well, a really good run. It will be Arsenal's corner as they try to nudge in front in this game. So deciding to make a personnel change at this juncture. And he's fired over the corner. Read it well, cleared it well. And I think, unfortunately for him, the less said about that attempt, the better. Well, he had a lot of options there, but he's chosen the wrong one. That was a poor effort. Fernandez. Sterling has it. Well, Chelsea being afforded too much space here. Well read to ease the pressure. into the final 20 minutes that's an exquisite pass from Gabriel Jesus well he would have been disappointed had he spilled that one definitely look as though they want to make this move count and nicely struck well the goalkeeper's life wasn't made quite as difficult as might have been the case well, if Chelsea score now, this place will erupt. The fans have been brilliant today. Rewarded for that brilliant high press. Kukureya. Could be a chance to break here. Well, they couldn't quite use that break in the manner that they'd hoped. Advantageous situation here for Chelsea developing. Options in the centre. Now well, they stop them in their tracks. Chelsea will get the throw in. Oh, great attacking play. An alert piece of defending. Martin Odegaard. Arsenal remain on the front foot. Can they find a winning goal? Shaping to shoot. And that is a terrific goal. Yeah, it's a wonderful strike. And, of course, worth double here today. Well, as you can see, he doesn't mess about here, does he? He's strong, well-balanced and skillful. That's a top-class finish. Well, it's a tale of four goals in this match now. 3-1 it is. Jackson on the ball. Well, he could really get at the opposition. Can he get one back? And that, a piece of goalkeeping you're going to see again and again and again. Can he deliver it with accuracy? That's an interesting pass. Just needs to steady himself. And the keeper nowhere to be found. Not that he's complaining. Well, as you can see, the defending is really poor. But he won't mind. It's a simple finish for him. A glut of goals. 5-1 it is. 
Conor Gallagher. Free kick to Chelsea. He's got to score! Oh, body in the way, crucially. Let's see about the delivery. And the referee decides enough is enough. It's the end of the game. Arsenal victorious. That's the main headline from this one. Well, it was a very assured performance, wasn't it? I was particularly impressed with their play going forward. Really lively, almost cutting through at will at times. The result was never much in doubt, if I'm honest.